hi guys welcome back to my channel so today I'm gonna do a little grocery haul um, I don't have much this is about $50 worth of stuff so it's not a lot but um, it's also not the healthiest um, I count calories I don't eat like super healthy right now I'm just focusing on counting calories so and I also have my boyfriend that lives with me and he is like the complete opposite of a healthy eater so yeah okay so I'm just gonna go ahead and start I have I got four of these waters um, because I drink water and my baby obviously needs water um, my boyfriend does not drink water at all so none of that's for him um he drinks dr. pepper and So I got two six packs of Dr. Pepper. I do not like Dr. Pepper at all. Um, when I do drink pop, I'm like a Coke, Pepsi kind of girl. But okay. And then I got some ingredients to make something for dinner tonight. Um, super unhealthy, but I've been doing pretty good on my diet. So I figured I would splurge or whatever. Um, and I saw this picture on Facebook today of this recipe, and it looked so good. So basically, you take like flaming hot chips. So I got these. Um, I also got regular tortilla shells and then regular nachos, just to have some options. So that's gonna be like the base, like the bottom, and then. And then you're gonna make like a taco meat. So I got hamburger. And I'm not gonna use this whole thing of hamburger, but I just bought the larger portion because it's just like cheaper to buy it like this. So hamburger with taco seasoning. So chips, um, taco meat. And you mix the taco meat. Um, on the picture, it had a picture of two containers of where is it at okay on the um, picture I had two containers of cheese but I got a thing of cheese and a thing of chunky habanero salsa and it's like really spicy so I'm going to mix the two and put that with the meat to kind of make it spicy because me and my boyfriend love spicy and then top it with some shredded cheese so super pumped for that that sounds so good so that's what we're having for dinner not healthy at all, but it just looks simple to make and it just looks really good. Okay. And I'm like hot and sweaty. That's why my face looks like oily. Okay, and what else did I get? Cheesecake for my boyfriend because he loves cheesecake. I'm not a big fan of cheesecake, but he loves it. And then a calzone. It's buffalo chicken. thought that sounded really good. And for half of the thing, it's only 190 calories. So it's really not that bad for counting calories. Got some egg rolls. Got some bacon. And I did not use, I used to hate bacon. But I don't know what it is. The past like week I've been loving bacon. And it's like, has like zero carbs and a lot of protein. So I usually eat that for breakfast with like eggs. Um, and I know I'm using paper bags right now. But I swear I, I have reusable bags from this store but I forgot them and I live in the country so I didn't want to drive all the way back just to grab my reusable bags when they have paper bags for like seven cents and then at the store I didn't know they had baby food but they have baby food and I got my baby some food and they come in these little pouches they're really cute this is prune apple butternut squash with quinoa sounds interesting this is butternut squash this is apple sweet potato. And he loves apples and sweet potatoes. So there's that. Okay. And then I got cereal. 
some oil for when my boyfriend wants to fry something. I really don't, I could probably go without oil, but my boyfriend cannot. Then I got chocolate pudding, vanilla pudding. Um, these were only like 90 cents and it's just a good little 100 calorie snack for when I'm having a sweet tooth. So got that. Um, and I'm noticing there's an extra one in here that I did not grab. So I'm thinking that this is my mom's because I went grocery shopping with my mom. And I think that she accidentally put that in mine. So got some extra pudding. And then cream of mushroom with tuna and egg noodles. Well, no, I didn't get egg noodles this time. I got um, bow tie noodles. And this, if you mix all of these ingredients together, it's like a really good tuna pasta thing. It's really simple, easy to make really good um like i said this is not like the healthiest shit but as long as you eat in moderation count your calories and be active you can lose weight and basically eat whatever you want um i've done it before i'm doing it currently you just gotta eat in moderation don't eat more than what you're supposed to you know um i just i know i'm the type of person that like i'll go all out and i'll buy a bunch of fruit and i'll buy like organic healthy shit and then it'll go to waste in my fridge and i won't eat it so i'm just trying to be realistic right now maybe in the future i will buy healthier ingredients but for right now this is what we're doing okay like i said my boyfriend loves cheesecake so i got this chocolate cheesecake i actually do like this cheesecake because it doesn't taste like cheesecake because it's chocolate um but like that is like the only sweet that I bought that I will like probably eat too much of. Like this pudding, this is really good for like a healthy day. It's 100 calories and it'll get rid of my sweet tooth. Um, but that I probably shouldn't have got because I know I'll eat more than I'm supposed to. But it's okay. We all have those days. And then I wasn't going to get macaroni because macaroni is another one of those things I stay clear from because I will eat too much of it. Overeat because... Um, it's really good and it's hard to only eat the serving size but I saw this macaroni and it's chipotle macaroni and it's supposed to be spicy um and I was like what the hell I've never seen that before and it sounds really good so I got that to try I'm going to because my cats are fighting but yeah it's basically everything I got it's kind of just like a middle of the week grocery run um, my big grocery run I did last week um, but yeah, I went to two stores to get this stuff. I went to a store called Aldi's, and then I went to Walmart. And yeah, um, I do not have my baby today. He, I just came home from dropping him off. He is with my mom, um, spending some time with his memo. Um, I always feel like I need a break. I need, like, alone time. And then when my baby is, like, gone... Like, I'm away from me. I'm like, oh my god, I miss my baby. Like, I want my baby back. But he's with his memo. And he'll be back home tomorrow. So, he's good. Um, but I miss him already. Like, crazy. But, yeah, that's everything that I got. So, I think I'm going to go because I'm going to start cooking that bomb-ass meal that I was talking about and yeah so thanks for watching and i'll see you guys later bye